Right, I think it's finally time to start starting uploading videos. What I'm aiming for is at least, I don't know, two a week. But my real goal is every day. Because I've been on YouTube five years now, I'm not done fuck all about it. So, I think it's time to start. I'm sort of starting in the worst place possible, on a really busy street. And it's kind of out of my comfort zone. I feel like everyone's watching me. But, I don't know, I'm hoping to get used to it, so, and I'm really tired. Me and Dad are off to York today, do some shopping and filming, I think. So, we have to leave at about 8 o'clock, so. We finally set off to York. <laughs> Again? <laughs> yeah. was a previous talk, a gold talk found in about 1870 and it was described by a local... So Dad's just finished his uh, video and we're just looking around the York Museum now and I do like history museums but you sort of bore me, I, you know what I mean, I find them fascinating, really fascinating but there's so much reading. And I have to be quiet. It's really awkward. I'm finding it hard to vlog. It's harder than it looks, trust me. And you see, this is interesting, but like, there's so much writing everywhere, and you have to read everything. And I just get so bored. Like, and there's something just like, you know, that. I don't find anything interesting about that. Now, I do like science museums. Science museums I can deal with because there's actually stuff to do. But historical museums, fascinating, but meh. This man right here, though, this man loves history museums. Mmm, and you love history museums as well. When you're older, you'll be bringing your progeny to one of these museums and to shitholes like Doncaster as well. Mm. <laughs> Amazing, amazing. It, yeah. Yep. <laughs> Fuck the system. <gasps> so me and Dad got a bit peckish, so we thought, why not come to our favourite cafe in York ever? Gatehouse Coffee. If you're ever in York, come here. It is absolutely incredible. And they've recently redone it. They've got like a wood floor and they've turned this old old wall into a nice cafe and the view you get is so amazing it's great i recommend everyone in york to come here and get it so we just got a bit peckish and we had me i had a panini yeah, i had a panini i had a uh, bacon and plum i think it was and dad had a chicken and pesto so good so good so what we're gonna do is we're just touring york now we've basically done all the filming and photographs that we need to do so I feel like, well, what we're going to do, what we said we were going to do, is going down to Stonegate to do a bit of shopping. And I'm looking for my prom suit, actually. And there's a uh, Moss Bros. I think that's where I'm going to get it. But I've got a few nice tuxedos there, so that's what I was planning to do. I'm just going to show you this view. It really is nice. Coffee here is amazing. So much better than Costa, Starbucks, or anything else similar. So good. We always actually look. Bloody ambulance. We always actually love this cafe because it's run by Americans and a church in America. And the Wi-Fi password is Jesus loves you. We love that. We love that. I am finding this vlog actually very hard. I mean, it takes a lot of courage to actually do it. Like I've come up here when there's nobody here because it's actually really cold up here. So even me and Dad moved down into the warm, warm room. But still, it's. It really is, like, it's quite embarrassing in public, to be honest. Lots of people look at you, but I guess, I guess people get used to it, and that's what I'm hoping will happen. I don't know, but still, like, in that Yorkshire Museum, I couldn't really do a whole lot. Like, it was so quiet, and every time I started talking, people looked. It was not that good, but still, life goes on. These stairs are so steep. So you have to squeeze. 
So we're just shopping in York at the current. <laughs> well, not. Just shopping, are we? No, no. Touring York. We're hanging um, out in York. We are hanging, we're out, hanging in York. out in York. And we just wanted to, you know, express this is why we love York. So. Whoa, look at that. That's a big window. Do you know that window is as big as a football field? <laughs> is it? It is. There you go. You've learned something. All done new. by one man, a chap called from Coventry called John Fortin. Look how beautiful that Fort building is. 1450, you know. There you go. You learn something new every day. You certainly do. Come. We've done it. We found the prom suit I need. It's all sorted now. Yeah, it's after many months of looking around, is that uh, he's eventually found something he does like. And <laughs> oh, oh, we've had a terrible day today, really. Is that we're now in York Outlet Centre. Oh, and God, it's hell. It's really hell here. And there's only a Thursday afternoon as well, isn't there's, it? There's no escape. I mean, like, it, it goes around in a horseshoe. It goes around in a circle. In a circle. Well, and... a square circle, doesn't it? Mm, yeah. It's a square. And you keep going round and round and round and you can't get out. But what have you found interesting here today? What have I found interesting? Yeah. What have I found interesting today? I don't know. Well, we've just been into the Speedo store to get him some size 26 pair ball strangler underwear, which, you know... Allowable in France, isn't oh, it? Oh, yeah, it's allowable here in England as well. So. Recommended. Mm -hmm. There Famous. we go. And, uh, <laughs> <laughs> By his school, anyway. By, by my school, yeah. yeah. You've got to make sure they're skimpy, don't yeah. you? As they say. <laughs> and we're also buying Dad a fresh pair of Crocs. I don't know, I think about shoes bellissimo. Really? Uh, we'll just have a look over there. And, uh, oh, yeah, so I see what you mean. There's a bored person there behind the counter. Oh, oh yeah. I'm going to show her. What? Turn it round there. Go on. Oh, no. Look, it's so there's open. another one there, quicker than that. This is where we're going to get shoes from. <laughs> nice. Isn't that, <laughs> that is nice. That is really yeah. friendly, actually. Yeah. Yeah. I bet they call her lover as well, mm. if it was a man. Mm. Anyway, we'll catch up when we leave the store, if we do. We surely are going to leave though. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. We'll have to find the car though. It's in blue zone. Yeah. I think. So me and Dad have just finished Pilates. Body pump is not on today, unfortunately, as the instructor is not here. But that's okay because I'm tired anyway. But Pilates, we love Pilates. Always good for ab exercises, which is, you know, perfect for me and Dad for summer. There you go. You can see the gym down here. Everyone working hard. We're just in this room here. This guy's got rock solid six ab, six, six ab, <laughs> ab, ab pack now. Pack abs. Six pack abs. There we go. <laughs> what, this is what Morrison's employees do now. They give you condoms and a pregnancy <laughs> test. You use condoms. <laughs> use condoms. <laughs> okay, I guess what I'd just like to say is thank you for watching my first vlog. It's definitely been something different, and hopefully I shall continue. If you really want to help me out by, you know, kicking off my channel, maybe drop it a like and maybe sub subscribe to see more. Hopefully I'm, uh, hopefully I'm going to be doing these every day now. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. So, bye.